Hi everybody, it's Martha here. I am doing something a little different this week and doing a quick video here for you since as I um, indicated in my last blog post, ooh, which may even be two weeks ago, I was worried that I might not um, be able to keep up with my weekly blog schedule during this super busy um, time of my trainings, my practice trainings for my Search Inside Yourself uh, two-day curriculum uh, trainings I've been doing. And then I just yesterday did a training for uh, at a staff retreat down uh, outside of Atlanta. So it's been um, a really packed and enriching couple of weeks. And then all of a sudden I realized that my art show, my in-home art show is a week from tomorrow. Uh, so I have, in the meantime, I've been ordering new inventory for that, hoping it was all going to get here. And then somehow not really on my radar screen was that I'm tomorrow um, all day long at a holiday bazaar here in Vienna at the Vienna Community Center. Uh, I will have a vendor table at the Vienna Women's Club Holiday Bazaar which will be my first time there, so I'm excited about it. And I just literally this afternoon opened some of the boxes with my new inventory that I've ordered from some of the work I've done this year and just thought it would be fun to share it with you quickly in a little video. So first off is um, I've um, are the new journals that I had that I had done. Uh, I used, I'm so excited with how they came out. So I have, um, I have one version that has a picture of a lotus that I took in Bali when we were there earlier this year. I have the um, the lotus come in a in a black cover, purple and uh, and green, and I have the other style is using the shot um, from the Muir Woods of the old growth redwoods that I took when I was in uh in berkeley for my search inside yourself training this fall and um so i have that in a black cover and a green cover and what i love about these journals and for those of you who have um who have done any of the search inside yourself training you know that journaling is a really big part of the mindfulness practices uh in that program and i use it also in my 30-day mindfulness meditation program uh i was really grateful to have had a, um, a meeting with my friend Deborah Ross, who is a certified journaling therapist. And she gave me just beautiful advice, both in terms of who I could order these customized journals from. Um, and it was Acorn Designs, a company up in New York that use, uses all eco-friendly uh, repurposed paper and um, and uh, supports artists who uh, who care about the environment. So they have um, a little description about the significance of the image that I took and uh, my wishes for you and uh, ways that you might use this journal. And I was so glad that Deborah gave me the, um, had me think about whether to have lined paper or plain paper. I. Uh, people who know me know I have a real hang up about my bad penmanship, so I always feel that I need lines on the paper. I actually designed this based on uh, my conversation with Deborah to have lined paper lines on one side and open on the other. So for people who like to doodle, but I've actually been using using mine um, writing on both sides of it, and I can't believe how freeing it is also to not be bound by the lines and. If you have a meditation practice, it's really been feeling to me like going from a feeling of focused meditation with the lines to open awareness meditation with the non-lines. So for those of you who um, don't know what I'm talking about and you're curious, let me know. We can uh, I can fill you in on that. So anyway, um, they are ju they just feel so good in my hand and they're um, really thick cardboard backing. So it's almost like having a little clipboard and you can flip it backwards. They're small um about four by seven i think and they fit in your purse um i just can't tell you how good they feel in your hands so um i will be i'm um, having uh, i didn't i didn't order a huge supply because i wasn't sure how they were going to come out so i will have some of those at the vienna community center tomorrow and then 
others at my uh, in-home art show on November 17th here um, in Vienna. And uh, I would love to sell out so I could order more. So if you are interested in, um, in checking those out or reserving um, a copy for yourself or gifts, they make great gifts, those are $14 a piece for the journals. And then my other new um, item, again, based on the suggestion of a friend, why don't I make coasters? So I have done that, actually. I have two, I will be um, selling two different sets of coasters. Um, I have my sepia, not very good um, display here. I have my sepia collection. Uh, this is the sepia collection. I've got hydrangea and my um, award-winning hibiscus abstract, the fritillaria and the Michaela Miranda sepia. Those are four by four squares. They've got a cork backing and a really nice, um, the images look really beautiful. So I have the sepia collection and then I also have a spring flower collection and that has the lily of the valley, um, dogwoods, Virginia state flower, um, quince, and um, I think I've got the, hmm, that's my other one. Oh, and the cherry blossoms, of course. So, um, Again, sorry, I'm new at the video thing, but this is my coaster sets. Each coaster set is $25 for the four. They make great gifts as well. And then I will have one new, um, one new set of greeting cards, and there will be four each, and it's going to be a collection of, um, of dogwoods and redwoods. So I'm just gonna have um, a box of eight cards for each of each of those images. So, um, and then I still will have um, some of the inventory from my um, from my my greeting card collections from last year, as well as my book Blooming into Mindfulness, and um, still on their way from my special metal uh, my special supplier uh, that brings in my my wall art on the metal. Um, those will be arriving next week, but uh, I'll have the new images that of that I've created this year, um, a lot of them from uh, from my travels this year, South, Southeast Asia, and I'm getting a really big print of that Redwoods, of that Redwoods image, which I can't wait to see. So anyway, um, that is my update, and um, thanks for indulging me with the little video instead of my, my blog post. Um, I just felt if I started writing, I would just keep on writing because I have so much riches going on right now. Um, this is my little, my little, placeholder and uh, catching up on all the marketing that I have not been doing for my artwork while I've been so busy with my um, purpose work also of my mindfulness training. Okay, so thanks everybody for listening and hope you're well. I uh, hope to see you either at the Vienna Community Center if you're local tomorrow, Saturday from 4, sorry, from 9.30 I think to 4.00 and uh or at my in-home art show and a lot of this stuff is not yet up on my website so shoot me a note if you are interested in ordering anything and when things settle down after thanksgiving i hope to get the website updated okay take care everybody thanks bye